So now that we know what is in the big box, it's time to put together what is in the big box, the Pache uh, paint booth. But the first step is to get it out of the big box. So welcome to the build video. Let's get started. All right, so there is everything out of the box. I, all right, so let's check out what is in that box there. All right, so we got some, all the uh, bolts there, that's bolts and some weather stripping or, or whatever you call it. And the uh, rip piece to attach the holes. I'd so to attach the vent hose to. All right, now she'll just go right back there like that. <clears throat> so here we go. Here are the end. There's the instructions. Doesn't look terrible. Five pieces. All right. So now that we, everything's out of the box, let's, let's figure something out. Let's get started. Let's come with a filter pre-installed. I believe there's also, and there is a, I believe that is the charcoal filter back there as well. So it did come with both filters. All right, there is the bottom plate. <clears throat> we'll start adding to it. So we're gonna need the two sides. We'll start with one of the sides. Something like, oh, something like that. All right, so I'll just keep going down and get the rest of those filled. I gotta get some uh, wrenches and some tools out and then we'll get the sides done. All right, so now that I got everything set, ready to go, I can get these all in there. Try to anyways. That's not working.
All right. Progress. I like making progress. So now we got that done. Turn it around so it's the front is technically facing us. There we go. So now the front is facing us. Let's get the uh, top panel on. Something like this, I guess. That was rather loud. Flush and run. That's good enough. Well, that'll be entertaining. So now we need to attach the rear pantle, panel, pantle, panel. I don't know what a pantle is. First, we need to apply some of this. So we need to apply some to the back side. It says to apply some of this rubber. Get some more bolts in there.
I think I messed up. In fact, I think uh, that one goes. that off and then See if, see if it attaches. There we go. Okay, so don't don't undo those screws. They that holds the uh, fan in place. Um, not really a. As you can see, there's a gap there. I'm going to have to mess with that a little bit and get that on there better. But for now, it is it is done. Let me get in. I guess yeah, not too noisy. Not very noisy at all. So you can see what it looks like inside. There's the filter there. There are a couple of some gaps. I knew about that from reading some of the reviews and of this online and how people Solved it. I'm just going to get some uh, some sealant, like maybe, I don't really sure, some type of a sealant that I can put around and seal up all of those areas, make it a little more airtight. I'm also, I'm going to get a look and see if, about finding a light that I can attach up here, something small out of the way, something LED. So, see what I can find this weekend at the store to permanently install a light up in there.
because this isn't translucent like my other one where I can put a light on top and it'll shine down through. I'm going to have to actually have a light inside. So I might as well permanently mount one and get one that's kind of nice. Well, I guess I won't mind that. It might get covered in overspray or anything. So there you go. That is the Haché booth. It is done. Didn't take that long. Wasn't that difficult. So thank you guys for watching and we'll see you next time.